YouTubers. People with nothing better to do. That'd be out here YouTubing. I got that. I got that. I got them. What am I doing? I haven't got a ecking clue. But I like it. I am gonna clue, but I gotta get out yeah. It's no good sitting in a house pretending you're old and grey. Unless you're old and grey sitting in a house. Thing is with um steel workers you always get left with boxes and boxes of bits of steel so I thought why not you know why not do something so the first thing I gotta do is this we'll just clean up the sharp edges on this stuff because we don't want anybody getting hurt now do we trouble is all we got is a stick welder. The TIG welder's not here. I haven't got a clue where the MIG welder is. I haven't seen that for weeks, so it could be anyway. Just clean this up a bit. Make sure there's no burrs, no burrs, burrs, burrs. Make sure there's no burrs. What I wanted was a bit of wood to fit into there. So when I weld them washers in, like that, they'll be the same height, won't they? Right, I found a nibbler and cut that out. I did film it but it wasn't recording. What I'm going to try and do is all cut tools there and then a skull. Shite and fucking pencils. Pencils. Whether they're any good. Square boss. One square coming into. Right, it's two holes are going to go there. We have a drill press which is not recommended so don't do it. Unless you're criminal, criminally insane. What is that for the word for you? Right, the finger is cutting anything like this. Make sure that's around that end. So if it wants to spin on you, it's not going to rip your hands out. What we're looking for now is nostrils. Roll me over, lay me down, and do it again. Oops, it's easy. What I got in the there is some steel cutting scroll saw blades. So Let's cut this bottom jaw off. We 
Got that looking sort of thing. Do is join these nostrils together. disc which is there. we call these flapper discs I have no idea what you call them put it in the comments below unwrap it it wouldn't be so bad if I had a axle would it really that's going to go in there like that, but bend, bend, bend. This will go quite easy obviously because there's no, there's only that bit of strength left in it and all the rest is colobolous. If you stay there and watch him, it's hoping to be something like that. Get out of the way with you. So it's going to be something like that. I'm going to take this in and see if I can rig it, rig it, rig it in the in the saw. So keep an eye on him. Right, where are you? There's his teeth. That's going in behind there. like a photo fit in it. Do you know this man? Yeah, I know him. Right, I want to mess these teeth up because nobody dies with good teeth. So, we need a messy up tight disc. Yet again, would it be handy to have a cutting disc? But we ain't got one. So he looks left, he looks right. Why he looks left, why he looks right, we don't know because there's nothing there. You're expecting the disc to grow out of thin air or something, I think. Alright, oh, I got a metal one there. So, I think I can mess them up with that. It's not as good, but it'll do. Shove them in there. Shove your false teeth in there, sir. Clamp you off. Relatively good, and the beauty of this thing, you can stand it up. They got me enough, you smokers. See, this fellow is a smoker. Tidy you up a bit. I'm only uh, taking burrs off for my safety. I don't like little cutty nickies. So it's for my safety, nobody else's, because nobody else is touching it by me. Are they? Bend these teeth. So we're going to use an old English method. Old English. And it's called a bloody big hammer. You're going to bend. Simple as. 
Simple as that. Let me know you don't think you got away. You are going in there as well. We want to get ready to weld this thing up in a minute. So we want to start curving big boy, but I don't want to damage my 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 thing. I don't want to damage ah, it. Is, it is, it is. So we're going to use a bit of protection. Not a lot. There. And there. And I want to bend it a bit there. So we're getting a nice bend. You see I know how to play with steel rather than wood. I rather my steel. So how far are we away? We're not walking far off there, but the teeth gotta fit in there quite nicely. That's fucking good, that is. You don't want your teeth falling out, do you? So they're gonna go in there like that. Right, they're ready, so what we want is a little clampy. Little clamp, anybody got a little clamp in this house? Right, it's gotta go in the fucking middle, otherwise it's gonna look fucking stupid. Unless he talks with a wisp. Who's that? Now this stuff is thin as paper, so to weld this with a stick rod, we're gonna have a laugh. Your it's all right. Right. The thing is, we need a plate for all this to go on, something like that, a back plate. Same, which I want, the same shape as his nut, his head. Rob, yeah, that's odd. Thanks for telling me. Okay. See where it was? Ow! See, very sharp. Must be careful. Very sharp. There's a young girl in the ring. Da -da 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 -da. I don't know what she's doing in the ring. See, it works when it wants to. I love metal. I love metal. I love metal in the morning. Right, that's going to be bent around there. Like that. As you bend it, then that round piece should snug up onto that. Can you just move over there a bit for me, please? Can you back up to there, lads? That's nice of you. Just bent that like that. That's all I done. I'm gonna go with that flow and weld that on there. Think I got it, think I got it. That's his that's his bottom jaws.
some people have noticed, this shed ain't very big. How's that? See anything? Yeah. So, we're into that sort of stage. I'm hoping to push that down there and get a weld inside so we're not we're hiding all our wells about from all this slag going on here. I just don't know if I can get some of that off. Come over here a bit. I will be back. Oh no you won't fucker. Stops that machine. That's the weak well. I pair the teeth on the bastard. Hey, don't call my mate a bastard. You see? Do you see? Well, if you don't see, because you're not even facing me. There you are. There you go. There's a end. Teeth. Teeth are going on there. Like it, I'll lump it. They're going on there. There you go. Told you. I uh, started around him. So let's keep the flow going a minute. his head on. I'm gonna try and get inside to weld it again. If I had if I had a TIG welder here I could uh, I could nip up there. Proper job but right we got him where we wanted him. We gotta curve them cheekbones a bit there. We're going to uh, make a, a little top of his head with that sort of idea. Yeah. And then we're just going to spend six months fucking cleaning it. Joke, that's joke. Right, come over here. Ow, you know that stays up for a long time, doesn't it? I got the grinder still plugged in. Spin yourself around. Oh, there it is. Stop wobbling. There you go. And we'll just have a fuck about with this. Hang it over the edge. So what we're gonna make is a banana. First of all, it would be nice to have a straight line for the change. Where's your rulers gone? No freaking idea. Oh, a Is that a ruler? Yep, that's a ruler. So what we're doing is basically that shape and that which I know it won't fit yet it's going to fit over his end I come up with that I 
that with that much. I reckon that'll do. We're going to leave a bit on the top to put an hole in. So wherever you want to hang it up. Or do we just put an hole in the back? You can put a screw through his eyeball. Might be better when I a screw through the eyeball. Yeah, we're going to weld the top of his nut on. Put your hand there for. Why is it up for? Uh, why have you got fingerless fucking gloves? Uh. You know you're too, too Babylonians. I always open the wrong fucking drawer. Come here. You might want to shut your eyes, yeah? This is the horror part. So you shut your eyes if you're squimmy. I drilled an hole in his eyeball. Right, just get them burrs off the back. I'm not going to do too much. Just, uh... I want a rough looking in fact you know it might might be better if you let it go a bit rusty. I got somebody to talk to now. Wonder what his name is. That's pretty uh pretty heavy lump. That's my mate. It's a bit more cleaning up, but uh, I ain't got time for that. I ain't got time for that. I ain't got time for that. <laughs> I knew you'd say something. What? Nothing. Talking to myself. Like I always do, don't we? Yes, yes. I got something to talk to now. <laughs> got the gear, got the fucking gear. Just need something to talk to.